G'day everyone, your buddy Dion here. Here we are out at my subdivision out at Wentworth and uh, the uh, builder developer's uh, worst enemy is the vandal. And yes, they've struck again. Here we've got some uh, vandalism where uh, uh, nothing to do with me obviously. Oh, I hope not anyway. I hope I'm not a boxhead. Uh, but uh, they put here boxhead is a dog. I don't know who boxhead is but obviously someone had a bit of a grief with um, with a certain person so yeah we've uh, organized for the graffiti removalist to come out and um, have a look I'll just come around here they uh, had a bit of a go on the back fence here as well um, but yeah I just wanted to do a quick little video on just to not really to show you the um, um, show you the graffiti per se but just to um, point out that when you're doing your developing and that that uh, these are all various issues there you go it had uh, box is a copper dog I'm just assuming they might be referring to the local police I'm not sure but anyway um, yeah as you can see I've had um, a bloke come out and just sample cleaning a panel and he's been able to get the paint off this first panel as you can see you can't really see anything there little outline if you look closely but he's going to come back out and finish the job now that I've sort of given him the go ahead but yeah I just wanted to quickly show you that uh, that uh, we're not immune to um, receiving uh, vandalism and it's one of those things on a project I'll just come around here and you can see they've had another go around here as well Box is a copper dog so I'm not sure who or what that refers to but copper I'm just assuming that someone uh, is not enjoying the uh, relationship with the local constabulary but uh, anyway um, yeah as I said just want to show you that um, you know, vandalism is one of those things that just costs you lots of money and it's something you need to be aware of uh, doing your projects because now I've got to pay someone to come out and clean this off and um, then you have to sort of start to be a lot more vigilant I've got to try and leave lights on in some of the houses that were in the middle of the building and that just to try and deter people and what have you but anyway that's all I sort of wanted to show you was just um, um, yeah make sure that you're vigilant and um, um, in and being prepared as well just for financially having to deal with this type of issue in your developments. Okay, bye for now. See ya.